in high definition. This is CBS 2 News at 11. Good evening, I'm Laura Diaz. And I'm Paul Major. Dentistry has come a long way. New technology could make your visit to the dentist even enjoyable. Can you imagine that? No more drilling. CBS 2 Susie Sa is live with details tonight. Hi there, Susie. Hi, Laura. You know, dental experts say that when you first get that toothache, ow, and then you go to the dentist to get those x-rays, it's probably too late by then. But what if you could see the damage before it's done? Nobody likes to drill. For some, it's the very noise that causes a toothache. But before you open wide, you may want to bite down on some incisor information because gone are the days of x-rays and metal explorers. The latest tooth technology helps illuminate problems before you know the drill. There are things that I would have fixed 10, 15 years ago I don't have to touch anymore. Researchers in the UK are developing a new tool to spot tooth decay before it begins. That uh, special microscope is called OCT. That lets us look at the tooth and then the Raman part of it looks at the chemicals that the germs may be releasing to tell us where they are. The lasers could be available commercially in five years, but in the interim, a buffet of other tools. The diagnodent, for example. And we can actually measure the amount of decay to a number, to a specific number, and decide, is this a tooth we want to fix? But dental experts say every instrument comes with limitations, and being able to see damage before it's done will mean a world or a mouthful of a difference. Anything to keep the drill away and a smile on your face. Isn't she have a pretty smile? Dental experts also suggest brushing your teeth with toothpaste that has calcium in it and chewing gum with xylitol. We're live in Upland tonight. Susie Saw, CBS 2 News. Back to you. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say I still believe we will never hear a child in the United States say, Mom, Dad, can we go to the dentist? Yeah. Just not going to happen. That's a very small limb you're out on. That is. uh, (laughs) Part of the United States is under a hurricane warning.